So-called space weather events can be traced to coronal mass ejections, or huge bursts of gas most often associated with solar flares. These solar storms send huge quantities of electromagnetic radiation towards the Earth. That's not good for power grids. A solar electromagnetic pulse, or EMP, could take entire power grids offline, plunging the world into darkness. In 1859, one of the biggest solar storms ever recorded, the Carrington event, hit the Earth. It disrupted telegraph systems and shocked telegraph operators. A much smaller solar storm in 1989 caused the collapse of Hydro-Quebec's electricity transmission system, resulting in a nine-hour power outage. In 2012, scientists observed a solar storm believed to be as big as the Carrington event. Fortunately, it missed Earth by about nine days. The U.S. is preparing for the next large solar EMP. It's studying potential effects of space weather on power grids, backing research to better model and predict space weather, and calling for greater cooperation among scientists and agencies at the international level.